All right, folks, time for uh, me to remove the second item out of this box. Uh, this is a multiple item unboxing. Just to make it look more realistic. Hey. All right, so one of the items I've been waiting for, this is a Sabrent Rocket MVME PCI Express M.2 uh, size 2280 solid state drive, high performance. So according to the reviews and some other things that I've seen, this is supposed to be as good as some of the Samsung drives. So um, you know me, if it's out there, we are going to test it out, check it out, make sure it actually is uh, uh, the real deal. So um, let's turn this over. Now it won't be in this video, um, but in the future I will run uh, both the CP user benchmark and I will do the um, the uh, crystal disk mark um, benchmark and we'll see what kind of scores we get and uh, hopefully they'll be high because this I tell you I got this on Amazon 30 bucks um, that's a heck of a deal if it's as good as it is I've gotten a couple of SSDs cheaper usually 128 um, I have a tendency to buy Samsung if you watch the channel you know they're my favorite all kinds of different Samsungs, mainly the EVO 970s and the PM 981s, which were just about the same thing. So let's get this open because this is an unboxing video. And I do hope these are uh, as advertised. So um, surprised, this seems a little cheaply packaged. Uh, yeah, if you've seen the Samsung one or any of the other ones, they don't put this cheap ass plastic in here. In this box, you know, it's about par for the course. Um, however, we'll get to this in a second. Um, so you've got a nice uh, user manual here. This uh, this actually is pretty good. Talk about the uh, one screw for fastening. Be nice if they told you the exact screwdriver to use. Um, now there's obviously multiple ones that work. Uh, number zero for sure, and uh, you know usually some kind of electronic screwdriver work as well. Um, simple stuff in here that they're talking about. Now I wonder you can't really read this, um, so let's take this over to my new toy. I got here this little guy that helps me read stuff that I can't read otherwise and hopefully will help you guys out so we can uh, look at this picture UEF BIOS utility advanced mode so power on okay that's about talking about motherboard BIOS so I buy gigabyte and um, MSI all the time, and so that doesn't look like their uh, uh, their motherboard BIOS. So that's not going to do me any good. Might do you guys some good, but uh, I don't know. I have no idea what brand that is. All right, so uh, as you can see, two places sometimes to put on motherboard. Uh, however, most of the time it's just a single slot, and. Uh, so that's probably what you'll see. There's a technique for putting it in an angle, which if you watch the channel, we've probably done that a hundred times on here. And then obviously you would screw it in. So they don't include a screw in here. Um, so you better have it with your motherboard. Otherwise, uh, you know, you got to get a hold of one. So let's take a look at this. And if this was not summertime, uh, I would not try and handle this by hand, folks. Um, first thing I noticed, this is really hard as shit to get out of here compared to the uh, competitors. And uh, I'm actually afraid I'm going to break this thing. Alright, so let's, uh, let's put this over the lens magnification so you can really get a good look at it. And hopefully that is uh, coming in focus. So they've got a nice label. And then the label obviously is covering the uh, 
the chips on here so there's the model ID number and uh, rocket and just like what we read on the top so eventually I will uh, install this we'll do some benchmarks maybe I'll even do a video of me putting uh, windows on it so hopefully you'll get to see that it's a rather easy process if uh, this works like the other ones if it doesn't uh, I will join the ranks of the ones that I resell on the good old eBay because I don't mess around with the ones that I can't install from a flash drive. Alright, thanks for checking out the video. Please like, please subscribe.